meet Rose. Born in the Prohibition era and standing just four feet nine inches tall, she's the spunkiest Polish bartender to ever shake a martini. At the little green house on Curtis Place, rules are sacred. From not running on the red shag carpet to respecting the panda figurines in the sunroom. But the golden rule? You must take a shot with Grandma Rose at her kitchen bar. No exceptions. Rose, who was the tenth of eleven children to immigrant farmers, mixed hard work with a healthy dash of mischief. Whether it was nearly burning down a barn or sneaking a $20 bill into your pocket for a chocolate bar, she's lived a life more colorful than the cocktails she served. A devout Catholic with a rosary in one hand and a whiskey sour in the other, she believes a good bartender does three things. Takes no bull, makes everyone feel like they belong, and has a blast doing it. Despite losing her husband and bearing the weight of grief, Rose never missed her Sunday shifts post-mass, turning the bar into a place of communion and comfort. Now at 97, though she's retired and the bar feels empty without her, the legend of Grandma Rose lives on. Back in her day, she'd pass you a drink with a slice of homemade cake and a pat on the back, reminding you that everyone is family. And Rose would say, holding up a glass, you're a beautiful person. Would you like a shot of whiskey? To honor Rose and all those who have committed their lives to the profession of bartending, Four Walls is releasing a limited edition t-shirt with 100% of the proceeds benefiting Tales of the Cocktail Foundation and its mission to educate, advance, and support the next generation of Roses within the global cocktail community.